said, big is my home. When the criticisms of him not leaving kind of came forth. It is JDC to open up in the frag department. Good Gush versus Isaac. Keeps his head down. Gives himself a second chance. Gives himself a third chance. But there's Krimbo. Speak of the devil. He'll come tearing over through middle. Over construction. Good lurk from Searson as well. Krimbo taking all of that attention by jumping down construction. Yeah, it's about time he gets one right. Yeah. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, never mind. Okay. Wait. Okay. Cause a little panic. JDC will come back. The insurance policy that goes down with the ship. I would say that Virtus Pro always a good example of that as well, right? Playing the online events ahead of the Rio run. Uh, just get the reps in. Bolt. Swinging around on site, trying to hold this ramp peak at bay. It is Snacks to short instead to turn back with the double kill. Searson kind of extending there with no trade potential. He had to pull through with that. Or they're in this spot. Tabson? Well, he gets dropped by Kios. That was a clean trade. It's smoke plumed and the flash. Very uncomfortable one for Kios to get the kill back, but he does. And there are some good shooters on the other side. But, yeah. This is what he's paid to do. Oh, oh my god, he got the shot off. CSGO Skins to strona, która oferuje codziennie darmową skrzynię, z której możesz trafić coś fajnego. Dodatkowo z kodem Industries otrzymasz darmowe 2,5 zł oraz plus 10% do depozytu. Aktualnie trwa event, doładowując konto lub otwierając skrzynie eventowe otrzymasz punkty, które możesz wymienić na epickie skiny. Strona oferuje również możliwość toczenia bitew z innymi graczami. Jeżeli zdobędziesz dużą ilość przedmiotów, będziesz mógł wymienić je na interesujące cię skiny dzięki funkcji Exchanger. Sprawdź link w opisie i odbierz darmowe bonusy. Whether you can cook it up. That's the question. No contest on ramp at all. We got four players just on the brink of it, pushing in. They signed okay. up for this with the passive volt angle, you know. Gamer Legion have chosen to put themselves in this spot. Maybe banking or hoping that it wouldn't wow. come through, but big slip in with the plant to boot. They've got two deagles still in play leaning back. But you've got Tapsing committed to the sandbags. You've got a good amount of utility on A core, a couple more flashes for Kios. One kid on Volt. One kid. To watch for a little sketchy very sketchy but the lineup smoke the defuse goes out oh Oof. hold on smoke lands a little shy i think it's not oh, going to yeah, cover the bomb and because of that krimbo may get vision on it there's the first tap he gets oh. the key on his headshot bolt's trying to defuse it and it's not going to go down deagles it's not even the ak's they bank on but the double deagles to come through with three trying to look down at the stairs but it's middle that the contact's coming in from. And Acor's caught out. Close box. Isaac has to disassemble with the Soul AK. And Soul set a Kevlar. He's still in the pocket to make this happen. Construction's gonna serve up a good distraction and get the kill. JDC to Volt. Isaac peeks out with the rifle. Then the second wave of pistols Ooh. comes in and Isaac does his job. He is set up by his teammates on two separate fronts. Can Tapson and Prosis recover? Galil kills quick. Snacks is right here. Tapson approaches cautiously and gets the second frag. And that could be enough unless Isaac has to go above and then beyond. Four kills demanded of him. Two deep, but four HP. And cautious of the A flank because they didn't see that Prosis was with Tapson. Yeah, the spacing was a little off there. So it gave a chance for Snacks to fight back. Isaac. He might get a little one right there, but a nice trade back from Process Instant. It was a T-Smoke on Sandbags. Makes sense of that after the pistols try to hold off, and they do so well enough. Trying to press up the top ramp, JDC to recover. It's the USP that ends up getting one. M4 still in play with Isaac. Trying to set him up with 20 seconds to go. Searson, Krimbo squeezing around the... Crane and Snacks, well, he's tucked into the base of ramp. Oh, on the smoke timing. Searson pulls the nade out, pushes Krimbo to the clutch. He's cautious of Snacks, who's now climbing up top. Crane, Krimbo's going to be exposed, and they've done mm. it. Gamer Legion coming through. But if they don't actually peek Acor, okay, that's a little... That's a, that's a little weak. That's just going to send him one player down. They at least get the pushback off the A ramp, but now they got 30 seconds, and no one's moved from A. Max is on Xbox. Good for the headshot. It's good for the second, even. Top Crane, 5-7, holds the line. Isaac now with the AK at a distance. Cleans up house. Knowledge tidbit, but we can save that for a second. Hang on to your wisdom. Oh, what? Okay, Snacks. Swing in the green. In with a second. Searson wants him. No chance. Snacks, the triple kill on the off. 
That close range shot was sick. Yeah. And it is another one to the tally of Gamer Legion, seemingly. You know, Krimbo's trying to crunch the numbers, trying to triangulate all the positions, figure this out. Reality is the op's gonna get you. The second top, I mean. Yeah. I kind of respect that. Yeah. Cool. We are not friends, we are business partners. Mm. Snacks presses down within the smokes. Volt just got vision before going blind. And Snacks is evading. Ugh. But standing on JDC, who's not got vision. So JDC, what? Late to come through. Snacks on the 5 7. He gets two frags because JDC and him just touch each other and then still he doesn't follow through. Oh boy. Snacks literally just body checks JDC, pushes him out of line, gets two more kills from it. Let's see if JDC can recover the round because that's going to leave something to be desired. Kioz creeps in, gets bomb possession at the 45 second mark, and we get Krimbo in another clutch. Has not been able to pull these off so far this half. And he will not be able to here either. A bit better shooting out of Gamer Legion, which held him back in the beginning of the game too. So that was overdue. And now we've got a push here from Big... Oh. Uh, the shadow appears. JDC barely even shows up. And that snack's gone. That's crazy how he just wasn't on his screen at all, it felt yeah, like. Yeah, just got smoked. Yeah. Meanwhile, the mid split goes swimmingly, and Isaac, ooh, okay. down on the B stairs, kills Krimbo, who gets in on the push. So, yeah, you may have taken the stairs control, but Snacks' death is not in vain. Vengeance from the Gamer Legion, process. Yeah, sorry, Kios. <laughs> no. He got spotted, buddy. He gets slammed against the wall. We'll see if Tapson, yes, sir, can come through with the kill from CT. So, back into the even keel. But this forward green control gives room for Process to push up, keeps Tabson back for the time being. We've got no kit on the play. We've got Tabson pushing into the site, realizing it's clear because both of them slip past. Gamer Legion go through the smoke. And time is of the essence. Mm. We, we, we literally started off by saying, even in this new big, you know, Krimbo remains the star. And uh, we're waiting. Searson, scout damage. Oh, taps in, just bends Excuse a bullet of the P250 uh. around the crane. All right, sure you can. Luckily for Gamer Legion, Snacks there to pick up the slack. Can he manage to shave Isaac, who's low health, off this? Yes, sir. Takes only a quarter damage, too, so still a winnable one. Kioz and Snacks going to want to rejoin again. S waiting. Crimbo. Oh, Come Crimbo. On. There it is. There's the clutch we wanted. Searson wants revenge, and he'll find it. They're really just gonna dry swing this? Ooh, scary. Two chances, That's but two missed shots. Oh. Dude, the nades this round have been crazy, and there's another one lined up here from Tapson. If they get on the bomb site, Searson finally connects one. Frag goes to default, no stoppage. JDC takes a swing through smoke, and it costs him a court trades back to Tabson. We've got Krimbo in another clutch, but low health on the two T's. He snaps it over, knows Acor's hands busy. Seven seconds, the clutch oh, he's halfway he's there, and he's got it because <laughs> he pushes around the side. Do a little ramp test. Doesn't die for coming out of that smoke. They're going to group up towards B. Krimbo's at the base of the stairs, hit by a Molotov. Can't really get out of here. Volt's going to find him back-to-back -back rounds. Now, JDC is closer this time. Could still take players off. Nice double. Mm. And a little more damage for Kios to have to deal with, too. Again, time is what it buys for Searson to get wow. to site. Lays down the law. Kios dropped. Another does tuck behind Tetris. And Snacks is slower on the approach out of middle. So Tabson should be able to hold that one back. They've got a minute still to press out. And Snacks decides now's the time. Comes around mid with a labored spray. An odd angle from Tabson bags the kill and could very well put big on 12. Acor to the clutch comes up. He saw you taps it in rotation, but dies out to the nade. Yeah, utility of B has been pretty ghastly lately. Had yeah. some weird paranormal activities over there. Yeah. Big swing. Snacks isn't going to lose the duel. Whole squad groups up behind the entry frag. Tabson looking to come out, and he'll get one. With little chip damage on Kioz and Isaac. Oh, Pearson looking for hurt, his right? lead impact. Ooh. Oh, dude. Every AD. round, every approach, these HEs are tearing through that Kevlar. Krimbo no longer lining the nade up, but Searson comes in with the kill instead. 
They do cross as the op is on cycle. Really good there from Gamer Legion to use that second they had to work. Searson now knows sight taken. Bomb being planted. Mm. Another nade for 47 damage. And the flank. But critically, Volt's alive. He's running back to short side. JDC pretty fast on this flank. And by taking Volt out, they never got that player back. So Snacks can't anchor. He's in the site. And he's surrounded on all three sides. Over the top goes Searson. And it's big impact from the opera out of big to clean up after impact from nades. Some things never change. They're just losing in German now. Yeah. <laughs> True. <laughs> Uh, here they go. Try to take a peek at a fountain. Oh, Ooh, JDC. Nice little fade away. It's time to leave. Taps in. He's going to chase one, okay. but he comes out of the stairs, okay. so he puts himself on full display to Acor, and that is three kills towards a easy snacks. Creeping out from Monster. Puts a bullet to the back of Prosis, and poor Krimbo's been outplayed. He's been out-rotated, finagled. And as he duels towards Long Bomb Plant B, so Gamer Legion... Pretty quick into the pistol, not wasting any time with it. That's true. Remind you of condo fees. Ugh, annual property tax. Oh, God. I, maybe I did. Maybe there's a difference. Uh, Crumbo on the pillar. Yeah, Prosis trying to chase it, but then he eats a flash. And because of that, the bomb has managed to get down into the water, which means plant gets delayed, but at least he's still alive. Heaven Smoke keeps Searson off it, too. They've been bombarding him with frag grenades today, but that one's negligible. And it is not the invitation they'd hoped for. So Gamer Legion straight to the B play. Lickety split. And four zeros their reward. Nine players in the server outside of the B play. Did Gamer Legion think that they could just kind of charge through as they did in the last round? Well, now the defender's in place. Still, it's a clean entry. Volt double kill. Process comes up from the water, but blind again. And the rest of the Gamer Legion there to just clean it up. They're running it. I like this. Yep. I haven't seen something like this for quite some time. Just yeah, old, straight up school. sprint past bathrooms. That's a snacks call. I suppose they're all snacks calls, but you know what I mean. Going back. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> He's really flipped the pages of the textbook. But God. does it work? Two kills come out of the CTs first as they arrive on long. That three-man cohort not able to put the bomb down because the ops got him covered. Isaac wants to come challenge, but he's cautious because he thinks Connector could catch him, and it's true. Tabson turns his head at the wrong time, and we're even back out, but they are sensing a chance to maybe push Wait, towards B. bomb? Yeah, they want off-site. Searson back in bathrooms. They're not going to anticipate Krimbo. No way. Volt yeah. gets cleared out by that one, and even with the three-man push on long, feels like it got stretched a little too thin. Yeah. But definitely there's still the slight chance that Isaac blindsides Searson and then he could grab that bomb. Maybe if he's got four seconds left. Nah, he's had to walk too much now. Oh. Acor's still sitting on one kill. But hey, hasn't been part of the action. Kios slides out through monster. Bomb is in tow with snacks. But seeing as this is starting to get stuffed by smoke. Yeah, okay. Kios is going to try to go one deeper. And in doing so, it's a 5v4 to big. There wasn't really much to do there for the rest of Gamer Legion as he ran out into the B site. Oh, oh man, I was thinking great spot for Searson up above. What a flick out of Acor, man. I mean, of course, if he had missed, he was completely cooked. Oh my god. Careful. Yeah. <laughs> Fully exposed here, man. Standing out of the open. Process doing the same thing. Missed op shot from Tapson. Nades come through to X. Boxes of Acor. Hold on, on. Trying to get the angle. It's the long player instead to connect. Doubling Ooh. down. Bolt. Excellent second headshot. And he is having himself a great second map. And Volt. Oh, man. That's a freebie. Krimbo's going to execute and... him. Acor standing out in the open. Krimbo oh approaching God. He closely. He's got it. the time for this. He doesn't have the kit, but there's one right in front of him. So he'll pick that up, no doubt. Acor oh misses. And Krimbo posts another clutch to keep big in a position to potentially tie. I think beating Gamer Legion would be a great sign of growth in this map, yeah, that would be just huge. in general. Um, you know, we talked about the online win versus Amcal. Ooh, goodbye. Uh -oh. No clutch, no head. Volt, he'll catch Prosis too, so this slow attack into the A play just gets torn apart. Three clean executions out of Gamer Legion to set them up CT pistol, dual Berettas. Supposed to seal the deal, but JDC comes out. Now sitting on 86 health. The cross should cost Searson. JDC oh. to the heaven frag. 
Hang on now. You've got Volt low HP. You've got this flank coming out from Snacks. That should be Snacks. able to catch Searson. Searson's watching for the water peak. Oh, he Never turns. Silent. Wow, nice one. Never good suspected a thing, but a second player Gush. And that's too much to ask. It's going to be Searson back into short with an off here. Now there's the commitment, but there's also the miss. And a lot of confidence for Searson to just come swinging out with the op in that spot. I mean, they just took it to you aggressively last round. They do it a second time, and Gamer Legion get the kill because of it. This is crazy. Ooh, look at that nade lineup. It's a volt time. Blind, but... Oh! Rostos does get ahead of it before he regains his vision. Volt, keeping his uh -oh. head tucked. Has two players to peek him at the same time. Pros is coming through with everything this round. One-man army. Cracks open the B site. Acorn not able to lay down lead right away, but he's got Prosis burning out of the bomb plant. Still a second miss shot, but the Molly does the whole entire job. And does that serve as enough of an opening? No. Acorn and Snacks lean back and Big have answered. That deep fountain smoke keeps anybody from really holding back his peak. So he locks in the playground fight instead. Flash is over. Isn't quite blind, but still dropped an Acorn quick trade frag back as Tapson's toppled. Snacks sliding in, keeping his head down. And Acor is still floating around long as well. Snacks. Oh, JDC actually flicking past him. Anticipating a long peak instead goes beyond Snacks. And with that, Acor is able to get down into heaven. We know what he's already done with that op from heaven. So not an easy one for big, but the flash is good. Process dead as Kioz locks it down gets bomb dropped in front of him and Searson's op just can't get into the engagement this one is gamer legions every day of the week yeah fair enough they've done well with their money five round game here I'm gonna need a few kills to go your way but it's one on the a side back for acor that makes things interesting and oh this one could make the difference i was thinking for the ct side Searson will just hand that one to him up we'll get another kill bomb goes down nice and at least a trade back here for JDC. Everybody's getting a little too over aggressive, I feel like. As he comes up connector, he should have bathrooms under wraps, which then puts the T's into an awkward spot. You plant for bathroom, snacks could clip you. You plant for bank. And you've got Isaac as another issue. Pick your poison big. It's a 2v2 to keep him in it. They decide to go towards bank, but Isaac has forfeited it as he leans closer towards the B site. No plans. They're gonna cover CT shortly. The Molly helps out a lot, but looks like JDC could instantly die right now. Yeah, snacks. Oh, oh. okay. No one <laughs> gets away, but all is good. They'll close it. There's that timing from snacks around the world from B site through T spawn. So let's see what snacks can call on this T side. Right now, A side's prime for the taking. Look at this rush straight up. Nothing gonna stop it. Deep angle from Crimbo would have to be Lady <laughs> Luck that, that gives you. Oh. There she is. There she is. Beauty. He is stuck on the smoke. Good flash in, but uh -oh. I mean, there's an entire pack yeah. of players. <laughs> if you think you're flashing into one or two CTs, you are wrong. Five members of Big awaiting that aggression and poor Snacks left alone against an entire Big Clan. Smoke on the bomb, kit to boot. They even keep their util. Yeah, I like that JDC is checking on this. No one's, he's making a lot of noise, so I wonder how this works out for him. <laughs> Maybe great if you have Krimbo hold that Ooh, down. What? Tabson wow. and Kios. No idea. Tabson just creeps out. Uh, Kios also come from the smoke. JDC trying to just throw out some nades towards lane. This is perfect. This oh, his own Tabson. flash. <laughs> Coming out. Flash. That's crazy. Sets himself up perfectly. Very confident okay. it was going to be a high angle peak. And attempt to get it going. 10 volts plant. Ah, uh, Crimbo slides up in front of it. Nice timing here from Crimbo. Your toes. Some guy's sticking a peg in your leg. <laughs> Arr, better than ever. Bottom mid held back again. You know, there's that constant challenge, right? Like the T side, it's got to attempt Ooh. it. It's got to keep the pressure up. You got to not give it all away for free. And in this instance, it does give Gamer Legion a better start to a round than what we've seen prior. Searson, chance now. We've seen some missed op shots from Searson that I don't like. He keeps going for the high peak, doesn't come. 
And now Kioz is just able to chase in, catch the headshot. Krimbo looking for the impact as his teammates fall all around him. Oh, headshots wow. from Kioz and Acor are excellent. And it's That's everything crazy. they needed to get this B site open. There's Gamer Legions first. Scott B bringing in the energy. He's a positive force as well. Ooh. Ooh and I'd okay. say a professional one as well. Yeah, for sure. Tapson can't get his as nicely as JDC did. Opening headshots. Nice. Acor posts up. And the close wall cleared from Kioz. Acor and Kioz with another bout of success coming out of the B entries. It was them last time to get Gamer Legions first. It is them again in round eight for the second. It kind of kind of looks like Searson doesn't really know how to op on this map, or at least isn't very comfortable on these angles. He's uh he's gotten outdone a few times now. Krimbo and Tabson equipped with the AKs. Krimbo's got a molly too, but he's got four players ahead of him. First one's for free. Shadow advantage is nice, but Volt swings through and gets nice the trade. entry. Very well done. It's a pistol towards spawn. It is Searson oh. on the flank, escorting Tabson's AK. He's very fast. Opera's not watching. Yeah, he should be taking the shot. There's an AK to pick up for free. It flushes the T's into Donut and Front Sight, but Snacks is all the way over at B. This one could very well get weird. CT's also not playing with a kit nor a Ooh, smoke, tag. but the smoke's not planted for Snacks as he's back on CT spawn. This Molotov timing could be huge. Remember, no kit, no smoke. There we go. That Molly's gonna burn bright. Snacks comes through with his flank out of CT. Isaac pressed into, and they'll get away with it. Gamer Legion, it comes at a cost. It gives Searson an op, but it's a third for the T side regardless. Damage again of the utility. Snacks is making a ton of sound okay. jumping out. That's a free one for JDC, who's just sitting, uh-oh, up top. Gun picked up. Ooh. What's happening? They Acorn. thought he left. But surely he sees that gun drop on the ground. I mean, I, unless yeah, the smoke was know. still fading. Yeah. I, I, what is happening? I don't know exactly. <laughs> okay. But it's funny. It is funny. It's provocative. Well, Cross is not being spotted here from Isaac. Okay. Good timing for Searson. Bomb dropped as well in his view. So Isaac was going for the search. Dead. Process loud on the approach. He's got bomb in front of him, right? That's going to be critical. Volt can try this late beat flank with 50 health. But Krimbo's oh, leaving while watching. Oh, no, I was going to say watching behind him. He should just be looking behind him. Oh, my God. He's worried Krimbo about CT corner. push. Wait, is he going to clear this? Oh, yeah, my God. There we go. Yep. Krimbo's presence of mind. Excellent. Confirmation on the last. Can't get the bomb back either. Poor Kioz just trying to scoop that up. Mm. Not Nothing there for the taking. Oh, well, Spirit didn't look invincible, I'll be honest. Yeah. So, take that with a grain of salt. Searson leaving Gamer Legion salty as they lose one mid. Molotov pressure for JDC. Doesn't give up his spot. They're also burning back of A site. JDC, good hold. Crimbo. Uh oh. Huh? Second player in the site. Lost track of him. And we've got a 2v2 back. Oh, nice angle from A core. Beautiful. Over the box, clipping Tabson. Can't help but respect that one. Tabson and Process, who has been having a very quiet game as everybody else is soaking up frags around him. Try to come through, splitting the 1v2. There's the kit he needs. I think he wishes he had at least a, either a molly or a smoke. Chance Krimbo still has one back sight. He walks over Krimbo's dead body, gets no more util for it. Does get the A main fight. Acor just swinging like that. Now he knows where Snacks is at. He could try to tap this, swing it, or full on stick. Snacks jiggles it, comes out. Oh my guys. god, he can get it. I and think as he, got he it. jumps on top of Bomb, I think Process just clutched this. Oh! Oh! Why my does Acor swing? Does he just walk out after this or what? He's waiting for them to come in and clear it, but. Nothing. Krimbo, Glock headshot, rocks him. Kioz is sitting on two HP as well. So Isaac, the dual Beretta's back B, maybe everything that they hold on with. Oh. Yo! Oh! He just hits shots like that sometimes, man. You love it. Oh. Holtz can't stop anybody getting into the donut. So now it's four members of Big about to hit A. Process yeah, has main sec. control. Acorn oh. popped him. 
Krimbo planting an acorn, toying with the thought of the temple challenge. As he comes out, we get a double back from Big. JDC, can he clutch it? Attack from both sides of Donut. No kit on the site player, but Kioz comes out with two health. He gets two kills with two bullets. With the rumblings of the exec as the smoke hits Donut, he drops off. Doesn't want to give himself over as a kill, but it's an invite for Big. Uh -oh. Good flash. flash. Great. Oh my god. A core down and out, and an AP MP9 retrieve. JDC again oh. the flashes. And he gets himself a kill and a half. Isaac holds off the CT spawn. That temple push will get punished. Snacks caught a lurk elsewhere, and Isaac is already starting to unravel the bomb site. We've got Krimbo with the Deagle in the site. We've got Tabson as the lurk no. behind two. Could the, the Fraggle soften Krimbo? And as he sits here, that temple player is eventually going to get an angle. Isaac's actually not coming at him. Missed shot, though. Not ideal. And the last player spotted. Tabson will still kill one. Kioz in the smoke. This no. is awkward. He's got a knife out. Oh my it's God. three seconds and Kioz gets the cover. What are we watching, Launders? <laughs> Snacks coming out of the lane peak. Nicely done. Shaving off JDC from Elbow, who definitely had a chance at that. Process trying to get away from the donut peak, but now him and Snacks have changed oh, spots. That's actually a great move from Process. I think he knows Snacks is still out there. And either way, Krimbo finds him, so this oh, timing is going to work out perfectly. Plus, the wall bang comes through from Krimbo, so Kioz is softened. And we get Tabson with the kill on Isaac. They just got to bring the bomb back around before they keep it going. Searson can't hold on. It's still a formidable position for the T side. CTs are going to be very nervous right now, and oh. Process gets his frag. That's the right play, actually. He had HP. He needed to take that duel, and he won it. Still possible for Gamer Legion as they come in with two decently health players. One health for Tabson after that nade. Kiyo's locked into the corner. Tabson hands busy on the plant. He's going in. He gets held. Pros is trying to do it all, but now it's that low health. This is a very winnable 1v3. Volt presses out. Krimbo team kill doesn't matter. Closes. Man, B is open right now when Tabson does want to walk into it. They've been calling out all the weak spots on this map. The prep has clearly been very good. As you come to expect with Big. Yeah, no kidding. And if Tabson plays his cards right or catches a lucky timing. Oh, he avoids massive jeopardy and they know it's a cave setup. Acor stuck behind the Molotov as well, so he's just stranded on lane. Krimbo looking to dance with Snacks, gets the headshot on him, anticipating another, but he pulls the nade out. Bad timing. And Kios, an open door to maintain man advantage. Searson's missed shot, doesn't get the trade. It's a new so round. JDC goes sprinting over towards the A site. Searson just throws caution to the wind in terms of the cave player that he knew would have been there. And wow. Kioz oh, is going to be the man of the round. Yep. Devil's in the details. Acor has not been able to have any free moments on the CT side. He gets hit down to 46 health again, but Isaac comes out from Red Room, challenging and not letting everything fall for free. We'll see Kioz impactful in the round prior being demanded of him again, but he's Molotoved off from holding long control, his two teammates also. So two sets of fire here on Kioz, left and right, plus the flash. Utility making his job hard. He'll still try to duel with this as bomb's gone down and the frag bounces past. Util all over, but he just keeps spraying away. And between him and Isaac, they've kept this one alive. Searson and Krimbo alive in the 2v3, softened up CTs for the retake. Searson waits, hits the headshot, and pushes Krimbo to a clutch. He hears him moving forward on the site. No kit between the two. They're thinking ramp and Krimbo. He's going to walk out free frag just like that. And as Krimbo tucks back in times of the essence, Volt will chase him down, has to pick up the kit and then go for the defuse. But in doing so, has lost his timing. Bomb's going to pop and Big will eliminate Gamer Legion. 13-6 map three after a vertigo win to start the series.